Hi guys, Evil Cake Genius here. I have a guest in my kitchen today. This is Elisa, and she's gonna uh, she's gonna play with us for funskies. So yay, there she is, cranking some stuff out. Um, here I'm just gonna turn. To yep, there you go. And so you can manhandle it a little bit more than that. There you go. There. Oh, beautiful. Okay. Is that what so I want? Yes, yeah, so that's okay. exactly what you want. So I would do one more and, and take more off, make it really thin because that way it's gonna stay. And if you hold that knife steady, it's gonna make it so your top is pretty much flat. And there she goes. Beautiful. That is gorgeous. Perfect. So we got our top done. And then um, before that sets up too much, we're gonna hit that with a little lily. And the key with Lil Roly, so if you can see all these, let's see if I can pop it up. Can you see all those little knife marks up there? Those are gonna go away. So the key with Lil Roly is you gotta hit it with cornstarch. And you have to go very light. So just give it a little there, yes. And it's gonna take a little bit, see? See? Oh, and they're just erasing. Yes. <laughs> that is kind of amazing. That is amazing. So I have a bottom plate on here that is a um, one of the cake heads plates. I usually do mine with a thinner plate. Um, our our uh, smarter than hell, which is a quarter inch bigger than the cake size. But since we're going to be using this comb, it's got points and it was going to dig into the cake. So um, I'm going to our uh, cake heads. Uh, what do they call them? I think we just call them frosting guide plates. But I'm leaving the top empty. I'm not putting plate up there because I want to um, I want to have a cool raw edge that we can paint. Um, so I'm gonna load this up again, and then we're gonna go. Now the trick on this is you gotta get it full yes. of. Right, so we're gonna do a second round around here. So go ahead and you can give it a little smooth with your. Um, just make sure it's sticky. On the. On the cake. Yeah. Okay. On the sides. Yeah. yeah. Make sure it's like mushed in there well and sticking. Okay, so oh, this is good. Okay, so now what we're gonna do because I want this see this cool top thing. Yep. So I'm gonna have you go a slightly above. So I want it to be like a quarter inch above. So we have a cool lip Lynch. on this sucker. Yep. And this is our pure butter buttercream recipe. And I did it with um, some Wickedly White to get it opaque before we turned it purple. Um, so then, yeah, do three more. Okay, entirely. Go all the way down. <laughs> and this is going to be a uh, witch's cake. Because, you know, everybody starts making Halloween stuff in August. Got to get ready to get ahead of it. <laughs> it's true. I know I started planning my costumes when I was, like, way earlier. Do Let's see. Just give it one swoop with this one. Okay. Just all the way around, and then we'll see kind of where we're at, you know? And that'll give us an idea of what we still need to do. So, obviously, we need more on top. Yeah. And that's that's how you tell. Okay. Like, you know, I don't expect you to, no. to know that. So, okay. There we go. I'll give it that one more hit again. There you go. And what's that gonna, what that's gonna do is push out this part. Like this, you mean? Yep, yep, do your thing. That's perfect. Yeah, that's, that's beautiful. Nice. A plus, hit it one more time. I want you to get this little lump off the middle. Okay. Although we are gonna put something really cool in the middle, so I wouldn't care if it was a little bit. Beautiful. Roly. I need more cornstarch. Is that too much pressure? Good. No, it's okay. It'll uh, it'll dissolve in there. Okay. See, look at it. It yeah. just erases itself. We are good to go. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. Okay. Good. Good. Okay. Done. Okay. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna test the sides again. Just by holding this up. And so now you see, I need a little more right in there. Mm -hmm. And if I hit, what I do is I go around and I just make it hit the board and see if there's any 
light and there's a little light. Mm -hmm. So I would do one more, I'm gonna fill you one more, and I'm gonna do one band just just okay. up here and then we can hit it. So yeah, just do the very top. Just one one strip. Over the top a little bit. Yep, there. And one one trip around. Oh, I messed that up right. No, you didn't. That looks good to me. That's perfect. Beauty. Okay. And so then we're gonna use this sucker again. Okay. And you're just gonna the key is this. You yep. wanna you don't have you can take it off in in small amounts. So um but you wanna keep it like this. If you start getting like this, then you can tip in and mm -hmm. then you have a teepee. Right. Okay. So hit it. I'm sorry. It's so really messy. <laughs> So I'm going to Whichever smooth it. Whichever makes sense for you. You're right. Okay. That's what sucks is that I'm a lefty, and so I kind of messed things. Well, I was like, am I being backwards? Yeah, or... no, that's me. Okay. That's Same side. Everything. We're just going to take off little bits at a time until um, it'll become apparent to us where we need to fill in, and that part we can just do with a knife. Am I getting something? You are. You are. Are you hitting the board? Are you touching that board down there? I'm touching something. Okay. Well, good. Then that means that we need to put a little bit more in there. So now what you want to do is take, use this to patch in any place that you have yeah. holes, okay. anywhere that it's not perfectly smooth. Would you do that on the bottom as well? Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. Cause your top is nice now. Cause remember how we beefed up the, you know, yeah. that top looks great. We just need to do that all over and that's how we tell. And again, this is a lot more frosting than I'm used to doing, I, but we'll, you'll see why later, guys. Yeah. Hit it. Oh, I'm kind of crooked. Oh, you're angly. Yeah. Keep this hand steady. Okay. Hold it. Don't move that hand at all. Only move this. And the most important thing is keep this straight. Off there. And again, you're going to hold that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That is beautiful. That is gorgeous. That's the money one. Oh, see, yeah, see. Totally. Okay, look how clean that is now. Now, if we wanted this to be a normal cake, we would just little rolly it now, and we'd be done. Uh, but we're gonna do uh, a, a different comb on it for fun. So you're gonna let this hit the guide plate, do 45 degrees, but don't let this tip in, and just go nice and slow super small. Hey, guys, Gorgeous. I've never done a comb. Though. Look at that. You're going to scrape it off. See it. Okay. And we're going to do one more hit. I want you to cram the bottom and hit that. Yep. Hit that board. And that's when it cleans yeah. up. And then I'm going to show you another trick. So what I'm going to do now, this is this is kind of the sneaky thing. Um, two <laughs> tricks. One, grab a buddy. So I'm going to have you hold it one more time. Okay. And this time, all you're going to do is focus on, is that the right side? Yes. <laughs> okay. I had it look too. <laughs> you are just going to hold this like this, and I'm going to turn. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. One. Push in. There you go. Okay, and that way there's no stop and start. Oh, money. Look at that. There you go. You got it. That is done. That ha -ha! You can see this is always kind of the sad part right there. It happens. Yeah. There's always a place where that, and that's where little really comes in. Oh. So, mm. again, Super light, 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 light. But just do I go around? Do I go up and down? With the I would leave the rest of this because the okay. rest of this looks really good. I would yep. just get that, and I'm gonna, yeah, 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 just that, because the rest of it looks fabulous. It's gone now. That's amazing. That's nice. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw it in the fridge, okay? Because we want this coolness, because we're gonna paint that gold. Um, and we're gonna throw it in the fridge and then we're gonna come back and we're gonna do a really cute cauldron cake topper for this. Sweet. Cool. Okay, so we're back and now we're gonna make a cauldron cake. Um, I'm gonna use this as the topper for my cake, but it makes the cutest um, little desserts for any Halloween party or <sighs> bakery case, anything. They're super cute. So anybody that doesn't already know, this is our three part mold. Um, and so that's one part. Uh, that's
that's two parts. And then these little liners. Well, I guess that makes it four parts, but who's counting, right? So this is the important thing is that that goes in there. So um, you start with this one. We are not putting anything in here. We're gonna do that in a second. Uh, it's, it's gonna be the cauldron top. And so we're gonna have to flip it over and do that second. But right now we're gonna make the cauldron. Uh, okay, so if you look very carefully and you don't have old crappy eyes like me, you can see that there is a very fine line. Can you see it where my hand is? Right there, and that is the fill line. So that tells you exactly how much chocolate goes to right there, that line right there, uh, is exactly how much chocolate you need to make this perfect. Mm. Now, I am old, I need readers. I don't have them all the time. Uh, quite frequently, I just blow right past that line. Uh, and it's okay, you'll just break off the extra stuff later. So don't don't panic, but there is a guide there. So, mm. okay, friend Elisa is gonna do this because you guys have seen me do it a thousand times. So we're gonna dust this first, the inside of these molds with, um, this is a new color for us, shiny as hell black. And here's a puffy brush and Elisa, I'm gonna have you come over and, and hit it. now. It, this works super, 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 super well with um, <sighs> silicone molds because it oh. sticks on there. Yeah. It doesn't work quite as well with hard molds. So am I just kind of painting there? Yeah. Or am I... you're, no, you're just, just, yeah, hit it, like wipe that whole thing. And so we're going to put it in here and it's going to be okay, um, but we're going to do, we're going to dust it again after. Because if this was a silicone mold, it would be hanging on there and super thick and crazy and, um, but it's not. So we're just gonna, yeah, and she's got it. And that's about what it's gonna look like. We'll just do that and we'll clean the counters later. Um, so this is Merkin's coating because I don't know about you, but I don't really feel like covering chocolate <laughs> every minute. Um, and we'll see if Elisa can get the line right. <laughs> oh geez, covered, covered in glitter. <laughs> about right that's yeah right. yeah that's right yeah I think so it's hard to tell especially when you're trying to do with the camera there okay Did and I then just give it a little tap down so oh. and then we'll see if we if it looks about right and then you put these in so you're gonna put these in there first I'll, do I push down? Yep. Do I, okay. Just a little bit. Because okay. we're going to, that's what the that's what the third part of the mold goes for. Ooh. It's going to push it down evenly. Okay. okay. And now chuck the other part of the mold on top of that. This? Yep. Like this? Yes. And that's what's going to push it down. Ooh. Yep. Fancy. Yeah. These are so cool. And then flip the whole thing over. Oh, I'm throwing my... Upside down. Okay. And now you can just like push down and you'll see it kind of oozes yeah, out yeah. and that way you know that you've got everything you need done so um we're gonna throw that in the fridge and we'll be back okay guys ecg back with you got my got my trusty assistant elise today elisa elisa, elisa. i blame you it's spelled funny um <laughs> this is the chocolate transfer sheet have you ever done chocolate transfer mm. sheets? They're kind of fun. Yeah. Um, the key is there's a shiny side and there's a dull side. The dull side is where the actual cocoa butter is. That's where you put the chocolate. The reason I'm saying this is because last time I did this, I did it on the shiny side and set it up in the fridge and took it off and there's absolutely nothing on the chocolate. And I thought, my, I thought my transfer sheet might be broken, but it wasn't, it was my brain. So um, we're gonna make some cool little things to put on our witchy cake on the sides. Um, and we're not gonna require like this whole sheet. These are giant, like you can wrap a cake in this. So um, at least I'm gonna have you like cut it and just cut it in half this way. And we're also gonna make a topper um, for the little, um, What's that thing that we just made? It's a little cauldron, too, using one of our new icing sheets. Um, so, that's another thing that's gonna happen. Oh, no. 
Well, it's like, I feel like I'm in your way. No, you're not. I'm in your way. <laughs> <laughs> this is a new sheet too. Um, these, no, this is totally different. This is, this is a good point. See, a lot of times people think that this is a transfer sheet and it's not. The transfer sheets only work with chocolate and they need heat um, to transfer. Um, you can do it. I've seen people do it on fondant before. If you actually use a heat gun, um, it'll transfer. But basically it's cocoa butter and it's gonna transfer onto the chocolate. These, which everybody knows because we make cool Oreos with them and stuff, and these are cut out. Um, these are icing sheets. They will stick to buttercream. They do not need heat. So we're gonna use this to make a cute little cake topper um, in a second once we get the rest of this. In. So anyway, uh, so this is, melted it off. Elisa. I'm giving her a bag of melted Merkins coating. That's about the right size. Okay. And just, just, just cover it. We want it covered. That's the whole spiel. I mean, it's smear, like. Absolutely. Run her out. And so all it's gonna do is, we're gonna get, I'd do more. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, we're gonna let this set up just a little bit, and then we're gonna cut out shapes, and then we're gonna put it in the fridge. Um, oh yeah, that's better. That's way better. Oh geez. Um, this is one of my favorite ways to decorate because it's got it's got some. It makes it looks like look like you have math skills that you don't really have. I like that. <laughs> Which is my favorite way to decorate. Yeah. See, that's beautiful. Okay. And then I would just do one swipe with this. Okay. Am I doing it with pressure or just? You're just smoothing it. It doesn't have to be. It's like, you could leave it how it is right now, but to see how that just smoothed it out. Look how beautiful that is. Yeah. That's yeah, I can look through that one more time because you got okay. that nice mm -hmm. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Okay. Okay, and just leave that. Don't worry about it. So we're gonna let this sit. And what's gonna happen is, because my counter is kind of cold. Um, Do I have to fix the bowl? No, you don't. We're just not gonna use that. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait, before it hardens. That's what I know it's killing you. And I know. I know you want to fix that corner, but no. This yeah. is going to be an exercise in chill. <laughs> in chill. So once it's no longer shiny, so right now you can mm -hmm. you see it's shiny. Once it's no longer shiny, which will not take long, um, it's already starting to be not shiny here. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to take that opportunity to cut circles. So just in the middle, I would start, try one. And you're not going to cut all the way through. You're just going to score it. Um, you said one. Middle? Yeah, right. wherever, wherever you want. Let's see what it does. So, and then, yep, twist it off. And, okay, perfect. Do the rest of them. Um, and you can do, I've got three different cutter sizes, so do whatever you want. You see how that's cutting beautifully? It's not snapping mm -hmm. yet. <coughs> and it's going to um, set it up. It's going to set up in the fridge after we do this and it would be too hard when it's fully set oh. to cut through nicely like yeah. this. That makes total yeah. sense. That's kind of fun. Mm -hmm. And these are going to be kind of like witchy bubbles on the side of our cake. It's such a great technique. Is it really? Yeah. It's one of my faves. And it's delicious too. So can't argue with that. Okay, I'll be done. Perfect. Okay, so you can see it's pretty much ready to roll. Mm -hmm. um, and so what we're gonna do, don't take it off now. If you do now, it probably hasn't grabbed onto that cocoa butter enough yet. Mm -hmm. So <coughs> what we're gonna do, <coughs> excuse me, what is happening? We're gonna slide it onto this cutting board. Pick it up with that. There you go, and yeah. we're gonna put it in the fridge. Okay. But you are not done, because we have to do that top of it. Um, oh. So this is our, it's a witch cake, so I'm gonna have you do. Um, Put them inside. Yeah, I okay. just want do do one of each, one zombie, one witch, because we're really just doing it as a a topper, um, and hopefully we have enough chocolate for this. <laughs> Otherwise, I can melt more. But we really only need just a thin disc. Perfect. Okay. So squeeze a tiny half of that in each of these, and then tap it out really good. Yeah. Throw those suckers in the fridge and we'll be back, Sweet. guys. Awesome. Hi, guys. Evil Cake Genius. I got distracted talking to the hubster. Um, and so we 
did all of this on camera when it had switched to um, photo. So we don't have video of this, but this is, um, uh, yeah, at least show them what we got. So this was the, yeah, we just popped out. and we popped them out. So yay, um, use your imagination, I'm sorry. And then these are our little zombies and witches that we popped out of our Oreo mold. So um, then we also just unmolded the two halves of our cauldron. And there is another video on my site of, of using the cauldron mold so you can see unmolding it. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna heat up a pan because we want these two pieces to go together. And so how, the best way to do that is to heat up a little pan or melt them both, stick them together, and they'll stay. So I'm gonna heat up one of my cake pans. I'm just running really hot water into it. And then uh, on the inside, you don't want it to be wet where the chocolate is touching. Um, and I have really hot water. Hmm. Yeah, this is not a child safe house. Not even by the long shot. Okay, so Elise, I'm gonna have you go ahead and put, and just give it a little rrr, 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 until it feels melty. See how melty? Yes. Now cram them together. There you go. Look at that. Yeah. So cute. Oh my God. Yeah, so perfect. cute. So we have a little tiny bit here yeah. that didn't come. Doesn't matter. We're going to be putting. Oh my God. This is so cute. Super cute. Ah, I love it. Okay. I'm going to set it like this. And uh, we're going to give it another dust. But wait, let me put something under it. Because that, this black is almost impossible to get off the counter. How many magic erasers in the world? Okay, so I would just give it another. But it did, it's nice. It's, it's, it's taken the color beautifully. It's definitely black, which is what the goal was. Yeah. Is this the goal? Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, that's fine. Let me move these out of the way. Don't worry, don't worry. Okay. <laughs> She's worried about my counter. As I made a giant get the, mess. Get the bottom edge too. Oh, so I can run it around. Yeah, yeah, hit it. Just hit the whole thing, man. I want this to be like super. That's a beautiful shine. Sweet. That's gorgeous. And then we're going to tip it off or how? I just kind of hit it a little more like that. Yeah, see? It, po it kind of buffs it yep. as it goes. So it's kind of beautiful. Okay, cool. So now we're going to make. Um, Look how shiny that is. Okay, uh, we're gonna make cauldron cakes. So this is a side project. It's gonna be the topper on our cool cake, but um, this in and of itself is a really cool thing to make. Um, so what we're gonna do, okay, now these are chocolate gloves. If you don't have them, go to Evil Cake Genius and get some. And it makes it so that you can move around chocolate without leaving fingerprints on it, which is not a good look. So Elisa's going to throw that right side up on our plate. Yeah, this is so cute. Uh, and then I just have this. This is cake tops. And I had to stop myself from eating them. Restraint. It's all about restraint. Um, so these are what we leveled off the cake. And we're going to use... Mm, that's too big. That's going to be just about right. So we're going to cut some pieces out of our little things and just put put like one layer in there. And it's going to get noisy. Right okay. And then I'm going to give you some green buttercream that we can layer it with. Just give a little shh in there. Perfect. Okay. And all the way through. Yep. <laughs> oh, you can have your you can take your chocolate gloves off. I was now. like, am I running? <laughs> am I running the concept? <laughs> Got you wearing the Mickey Mouse gloves. <laughs>
And guys, this is my favorite because it's all that leftover crap that I usually throw away. Look at that. Sweet. Sweet. Okay, can we put just like a super thin little circle on there? Mm -hmm. Cause then I wanna, I'm gonna, we're gonna pipe, um, we're gonna pipe it like kind of bubbly. Yeah, like go ahead, manhandle it, you can do it. Okay. okay. Yeah, and then, and then just like pipe some little like squiggles. And I want it to be taller in the middle than around the edge. There you go, there you go. And then, and then you got it. That's oh my gosh, how perfect. good is that? <laughs> okay, and then it needs, Sprinkles, eyeballs. In any situation yeah, or just or whatever you want. Which is choice. Oh my god, I love the eyeballs. They make me so happy. They're so cute. <sighs> and then, and then. Super cute. Okay. And then I'd throw the witch fuel right in the top. Because now I'm gonna break the rules here. So I'm gonna leave finger. Isn't that the cutest thing you've ever seen? So like, cute. I'm cute. Uh, and then go ahead and stand that right up on top. I go upwards because it's gonna be on top of the cake. So make it stand straight like up. Like this. You got it. Oh, got you. you got it. Just like this. Yep. 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 Mega cute. So cute. Yeah. So that's our cake topper right there. Whee! Okay, we're gonna throw this in the fridge so that that gets set up. So we're gonna finish this baby up. So um, today, I want that top edge to be painted like rough, like cool, like, you know, like quarter inch down um, gold. Okay. And we're gonna use our BCG Incredible Paint. And then I'm just gonna paint it because we want it to be kind of rough and cool. That's gorgeous. Rougher and That's different. That's absolutely or... perfect. Yeah, I love that. Get out of the way. Yeah. Oh God, look at that. That's such a pretty color. Yeah. Do you want me to go around this side? Or? Whatever you want, it's your cake. I think it looks great. Uh, let's go. <laughs> I like Perfect. having it just on the on the top like that. Perfect. Ooh, Perfect. Okay. And then let's do let's get this out of here. So right now we're gonna attach this. So I just kind of want them like coming up. Pick whatever side you want. So pick your best front. Let's see. So that's where we did little. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's right gorgeous. Here. That's yeah, gorgeous. Right yep, that's perfect. And then um, you're gonna use the well. Let's use purple, I suppose, huh? This or would it be festive to have the green showing? What a that might be kind of cool. You're the genius. Oh, wait a second. I can't decide. Green. Let's do the green. Okay. okay. So so I think what might be fun is I'm going to do one and then yep. you're going to do the next one, right? Yep. We're going to do a rosette. So okay. and make different sizes coming all the way up the side of the cake. Oh, my land top. Yep. Gorgeous. Damn. That's a hell of a rosette. Now that's how we're gonna attach. Look at that, that's so cute. Well, but wait, but we're attaching our stuff oh, based yeah. on that. So we're gonna throw that. So then we throw these bad boys. Um, we don't, we want it to look, so we wanna see some of this pretty piping. Mm -hmm. um, so I would say put them like here, here, like off center on purpose so that we can see all of those. And any particular ones? I don't care, no. Even if there's like white on it? Make the white here. So like if this one's going here, mm -hmm. you make it so the white doesn't show. Disappears oh, right yeah. into the green. Yep. I did one. I was not gonna touch this thing. <laughs> I lied. So yeah, just like pop them in there wherever you think. And you can always go back and add more green if you want. And can they go different ways? Yeah, or? you can do whatever you want. 
which is choice. See, look at that. Never happened. That is perfectly clean. Ha! Are you saving? No, I'm not saving anything. <laughs> Do you want it flatter? Whatever. So it's coming against like. It looks really cool. I mean? from, it looks really cool from here. Okay. Yeah, that is pretty cool. Sweet. I want more. Okay. Where would you like them? I don't know. Ooh, put some in between, like right there. I want one there. Yeah. Yeah, 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 that yeah, looks yeah. Cool. yeah. Uh, yep, yep, yep. And then maybe. Oh yeah, yeah, piping. yeah, yeah. And you might have to put a little more green somewhere because I think I want maybe. Let's do one that comes up like right here. Huh? Yeah. So would you still do a rosette on here? Oh, why not? Yeah. Let's plunk that on there. <gasps> Super cool. Stupid cute. Yeah. Ah! Okay, that is ridiculously adorable. Look at that. Okay, stand up. <clears throat> And now we're gonna get, all we have to do is get our, God, that's cute. I'm glad we did the green rosette show. Yeah, I think so too. Um, now I'm gonna get our um, topper. Okay, so now, <laughs> so like one it. of us is gonna follow the rules and use the chocolate thumbs. And then I'm gonna make a little tiny bloom there so that we can put that on top. Just like this? Yeah. Okay, that's like so cute. Stupidly festive and yes. adorable. And it's got a mini cake in inside it. it. Yes, that's, cute. that's so cute. That's super cute. Let's throw some sprinklies. Um, I've got bones. Where and are the sprinkles going? Right around the base. Super. Yeah, so we don't see the green glob as much. Oh my god, that's so cute. Oh, like that close you don't to the green. Have to, but, I mean, the green glob is fine. But <laughs> I totally was doing it with my glove. <laughs> The gloves now have a shade of purple, so take them off. <laughs> Can't be trusted. That is stupidly cute. And since the cake is set up, if you're really worried about it, you can just use this to... <coughs> oh, them. to bring them in there. Yeah. But look at that, guys. Yes, how fun is that? We have a mega witchy cake. Cute. That was easy. Lots of new techniques in that one cake, and... Um, Stupidly cute. So mm -hmm. enjoy, guys.